I got really affected over this, and I'm going to tell you why. Morgan Spurlock. This was the star of the uh, documentary Super Size Me. Um, you know, where he ate, I guess, McDonald's. Remember, it was like a whole month. Like, he could only eat McDonald's. I think there was a Super Size Me, too. I didn't really, I didn't see that one, though. I saw the first one. And I remember, so he, before he, he, he did this, before he went on this quest of eating McDonald's every day, right, for like 30 days, he had to get a complete medical checkup. And I remember when I first watched this, I was sitting down with my wife and I was making my wife laugh, you know. I was like, the guy was in great health. Like he was in perfect, perfect weight, very skinny, you know, not too much body fat. You know, everything was cholesterol was good. You know, his heart was good. Everything was good. And the doctor said, you're in like prime health. So I remember telling my wife, I'm like, I'm not in prime health. I was thinking to myself, man, like. I'm shot, man. I This guy's eating McDonald's for 30 days. I'm eating McDonald's since I'm 10 years old. I'm like 46 years old. I've been eating McDonald's for 36 years. Forget about it. My own Burger King, Wendy's, Chick-fil-A. I mean, everything I eat. Fast food, Taco Bell, pizza, Italian food, steaks. This guy was in perfect health. He was just doing this as like a joke. You understand? He was doing this as a, as a gag for a, for a movie, for a documentary. He doesn't normally eat this way. I remember he, his, I guess it was his wife. Um, I'm not sure if it was his girlfriend or his wife, but she was a vegetarian. And, and every day, that's how they would eat. You know, I, I don't know if they were vegans. They were possibly vegans, but he ate very healthy. Him and his girlfriend or his wife. I don't remember when I watched the documentary if he was married. But um, they ate very, very healthy. And I just remember thinking to myself when I was watching that, I'm like, my God, I am so fat. I am so out of shape. I'm so not healthy. This guy, like he's just doing, like the guy is a healthy guy. He's in great shape. And he's only doing this for a movie. Well, he passed away. He died. This guy. Can you believe this? I, I'm like in shock over this. It was complications of cancer. He was only 53 years old. It just goes to show you. First of all, I would like to say, God bless you. May you rest in peace. And God bless you and your family. But my God, it's like, I, 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 I looked up to this guy. I, I idolized him. I was like, this guy is in great health. You know, and he's only doing this as a joke. Like, I'm the idiot. I'm the fat American that loves fast food, you know, that lives on it like a fat, disgusting blob. So all I do is eat fast food, fast food, fast food, fast food. And there's a guy who doesn't eat fast food. He eats healthy. You know, him and his girlfriend or wife, you know, they eat every day, you know, very healthy, vegan vegetables, no meat. And he passed away. I don't know. I just got affected by this. I, 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 I mean, we all have to die at some point. I know this, but this, this was a shocker. I was shocked by this. For Fifty-three years old. Guy was a great. The doctors gave him a perfect bill of health. Now the the funny thing I mean, which was funny, was after he ate McDonald's for the thirty days, the doctors started saying that he his health was deteriorating. He was in really really bad health. The doctor said you have to stop. You know. Everything, your, your cholesterol is getting higher, tri triglycerides, uh, this, that, all these things. And he was only doing it for a month. I'm doing it since I'm 10, 36 years. I don't know. This affected me. God bless you, brother. I really enjoyed Super Size Me. And I know he was doing that in a way to help the world. Isn't that crazy? He was doing that to help the world. You know, he was saying, you know, you don't want to do this. There's too much obesity in America and... And even children, he was saying, you know, children are, are, are getting, you know, very, very heavy over, you know, fast food. And th that was the reason why he did all of this. It was like a message for us to stop. But now he passed away. It's just weird. I don't know. It's, it's just, I don't know. This whole thing freaked me out. I can't explain it. It just freaked me out. I'm saying to myself, I'm alive still. I'm still, like, I'm still here. Thank God. I mean, you know, I got to be here for my family. My family needs me. But I'm saying to myself, I'm still here. And he, he's gone. He passed away. This is a guy who had just a really healthy lifestyle. Very skinny, healthy. The doctors gave him 100% clean bill of health. He was only doing this. This was a joke. He was only doing this. He doesn't really eat McDonald's. He was doing it as a point prover. He was doing it, he was doing it to tell all of us, all of us that were idiots, that we're doing it. Because this is very unhealthy. But then he passes away. It's terrible, right? 53 years old. Cancer. Effing cancer. Effing cancer.
Anyway, this, this affected me. This really affected me. God bless you. May you rest in peace. God bless you and God bless your family.